if you are somebody who thinks that confession is all about sins then this video is for you hello everyone my name is matthew and in today's video i am going to share with you something which is bothering you for a long long time you must have heard your catechists or your sunday school teachers or the elders of the church tell you that you must go for confession but you don't want to go for confession because you know sometimes telling about my own filthy wrong doings to a priest uh, might seem very off and it does not seem logical and sometimes you think ah, i don't have much to say i have not committed many sins not serious sins so these are very petty sins maybe i'll go once a year or but is confession only about confessing your sins what does confession mean what is this sacrament of reconciliation the meaning of reconciliation is a way to reconcile the relation to restore the relation between two people and in this case to restore the relation between you and christ so if that is what reconciliation means then is it only about sins is it only sins that takes you away from christ just listen what the catechism says about what is it that we must take for confession essential elements of every confession are an examination of conscience contrition a purpose of amendment confession and penance so mark the word amendment amendment means to amend to restore if whatever is broken to repair that relation between two people between two person and if it is only sins that is taking away me from my lord then i am wrong because most of us have this attitude of not admitting a sin it is a very common human nature but there is something else and that is anything which is bothering you anything which is taking you away from christ you are facing some problem you have some uneasiness in your heart which is making your focus more of the problem centric than christ centric and that is what you must go and reveal and use the sacrament of reconciliation to remove that from your head and bring your focus back to christ after all it is all about rebuilding the relation between you and christ so anything not just sins but anything which is taking you away from christ is required to be removed through the sacrament is required to be absorbed through the sacrament of reconciliation and that is what i want to tell you today that sacrament of reconciliation or confession is not just about confessing your sins it is also to share with the priest who is there on the chair and who acts on behalf and from the power uh, in invested upon him by christ himself to absolve sins to counsel you confession is also about counseling it is not just about you know giving you penance and a penance and all will come but the first thing that you need to do is you need to unload your uh, weights that you are carrying on your shoulder carrying in your heart and tell me something is it only about the guilt of sins don't we have uh, various problems in life worries in life worries about bad news that we have heard uh, the insecurities doubts fears isn't it about those things don't you uh, don't you realize that most of the times when we are supposed to pray we don't or when we are supposed to read the scripture we don't because that time you are busy thinking about these problems or these issues that have come up in life it is also about these things and we must be sincere enough to realize this but if you are somebody who genuinely didn't know about this then it's good news for you that you can go for confession you can go and uh, use the sacrament of reconciliation for addressing these problems as well maybe you will not find solutions to these problems but the solution is christ and your focus will be back on christ and not on these problems once my focus is back on christ these problems will go away because christ has the solution to all problems so i encourage you to go for confession not just to confess your sins but to share all the problems and unload yourself of all the burdens in life 